What is going on, guys? It's Buckeyes Gaming here to bring you our first server review. Can't wait to get started. I'm doing that on the same server I was in for the uh, first revamp video, and what a better way to start the video than being stuck in a wall. So you can see right here, I'm in a little battle with this guy. I don't know his name. His uh, let's see, I can check right here, like Pon Pon something. But uh, you get one of these guys in every single lobby. I, I really don't like this server for this reason. He's one of those guys that builds a shack for his base and then goes around with a gun and shoots people. You've probably seen a lot of them. Um, a lot of them are guests because they don't realize that other humans might be in A lot of them are kids who are safe chatters. That includes guests. It's like 90% of them. And then the other 10% are children. So, you can see, like, maybe one or two of these guys is fine, but every single lobby you try to go on to, then one of these guys is here. Every single time. So, what he does is he builds a, or what they do, excuse me, is they build this tiny little shack, and then sit up there with a high-powered gun that they got by murdering people, and then just pick people off. I mean, I guess that would be considered strategy, but... It gets to the point where you can't really enjoy it, because as soon as you move, you die. And because I had just joined, then this guy had all the great equipment. I think he had like 10,000 points. I had 200. I, I think I killed him once before I started the video. And um, so normally what I would do is this guy, most of the time, these guys, let's just call them trolls, the troll will have like no equipment, right? So you just shoot him a couple times and then slowly evolve better equipment and then keep shooting him, right? Then he'll get pissed off and leave. Not this guy. See, he had been doing this for at least hours, judging by the 10,000 points, like two hours before I got here. And he just keeps killing you and killing you. So then I try putting this thing up here to try to like make the stairs up to his house. That didn't work because I'm not allowed to breathe without him shooting me. So I tried pushing it, he kills me, and then shoves it off the edge. And then when I try shooting him, Roblox has a really glitchy combat system. So a lot of the times when you're trying to shoot him, it just won't register the damage. So right here he kills me, then he's gonna jump down, I'm gonna keep shooting him, it's not gonna do any damage, and he's gonna push it right off the cliff. So, look, there he is shoving it, I'm shooting him, where my mouse is, and everybody on Roblox is a dead eye, it's not like I'm missing, and then I die. And then on top of that, I'm trying to kill the troll, right, and then some other guy comes up named Evan, and then just starts shooting me, and I'm like, what the heck, look, right there, I can't even tell who that was, I'm pretty sure it was Evan, like, that's, that's stupid, you can obviously tell here that we're re uniting against the common idiot, and then he kills me, I'm like, what the heck, I'm trying to help you out here. So I didn't want the whole server, or not server, I'm thinking of Minecraft. I didn't want the uh, whole whole uh, review to be about this this one guy, so I'm going to actually get into the game. Pretty much, it's one of those sandbox games. Sandblox, see what I did? Anyway, um, that name derives from the sandbox where you build sandcastles, right? So they give you a building tool, a lot of stuff to build with, a garbage thing, a starting gun, and then it said I had like a 50 cal. I don't know. I didn't actually use them. I got killed trying to shoot him with the 50 cal once. And uh, I'd like to say on a realistic note, I know this is a video game, but P39 shoots a big enough round that it probably would kill him on the, maybe the second shot. Because handguns, um, I think the biggest caliber you can fire a, like a Beretta in is a free. And I'm guessing this is like a 9mm. So that's bigger than a 22. And if you can get killed with a 22, you can get killed with a 9mm. So I just don't want to seem like one of those kids who doesn't know what I'm talking about. So anyway, you start off with a P39, 50, 50 cal, whatever that does, and then something called a drive. So then I'm trying to go up here and hide from the troll. Anyway, I don't know where this, what this thing does. I think you walk through the thing to get VIP. I touched a railing, and apparently that's a sin. So I died. And, uh... So... Anyway, it's a sandbox game. It would be a lot better if they had some sort of griefing. Griefing. Think it a mind. I'm sorry. Um, had some sort of trolling control on it. 
as you can see, you just keep getting blasted and blasted by the same guy. I really think there should be some kind of limit, almost like you're hunting deer, for how many kills per minute you can get. And then, like, they should have admins or something on here. Um, because you can see the guy, he's just walking around shooting, and he doesn't even care. He's a safe chatter. I tried reaching him before the video started. I typed right there, hey guys, I'm going to do me a favor and stop shooting. Um, of course he won't listen to them. Um, okay, back to review. I ended up, this guy left before the video was over. So, overall, the concept of the game is great, okay? You've got a, you've got a little pallet to build on. You can build as tall as you want, but you can't build out of your pallet, right? So, and it makes it really annoying at first because you get experience from killing people. You start off with 100 experience. So, after a while, you get sick of getting shot because I guarantee you there's going to be a guy like what, what I'm do dealing with here, the troll, and it just gets ugly. So, what I usually do is just build one of these little shelter thingies, make it three tall, keep the trolls out, and build it on all sides. That way I can get maximum building and maximum security. So, with the server, uh, server game itself, it would score like a 9 out of 10. There's nothing really wrong with it. I do like the uh, beta version of it better, or the alpha, whichever one came first. I know beta's later in the alphabet, but I don't know. Um, there were guns. Then he added a Voxel added uh, equipment like helmets, body plate. Those things do uh, wonders for your health. However, they do sacrifice some of your speed. There's also a gun shop. The more experience you get, the better guns you can unlock. Now, however, you get experience from killing people. This guy obviously wants to unlock the best gun, so he's walking around shooting people, right? And there's not really a defense for that, because uh, you can shoot through walls, you can wall bang people pretty easily on here, and it uh, makes it pretty sloppy when you're trying to build like this, because you're so busy trying to cover up the fort so that the trolls can't get in, and um, you can't really enjoy it. So, if I had to rate the server, I would probably rate it, hmm, I don't know, what, what could I rate it? On a scale of 1 to 100, I would probably make it a 75, mainly because of the troll aspect, but also because some of the things I don't like is the pallets are too small, he could expand the world a whole lot more, and he keeps on doing too much to it. The only thing that stops the artist from painting a great picture is himself. You know, he's trying to overpaint it, trying to make it so awesome. And when you've got 5 million visits on it, I don't think the popularity is going to be the issue, unlike this channel. Um, I think that it's reached a climax. He's, it's great where it's at. You know, I, I thought it was great in the beginning. Then he added helmets, which were cool. And uh, then he added chest packs and stuff like that, and then grenades. I, I, I don't know. I didn't actually play on the new server for a while. I haven't been on Roblox, much less the server, in forever. So, some things he could use to improve it. Voxhall, if he just happens to be watching this. So, oh yeah, by the way, the troll tries to friend request me right here. I'm like, nope, denied. Anyway, he could improve it, making it a little more simple. Taking out some of the equipment and whatnot, some of the things that you need... Uh, could just be guns and building. Also, he needs to make the pallets bigger. A lot of times I want to build it out wider and I don't have that option. One more thing is he could limit the uh, kills on here, I guess you could say. The amount of people you can shoot per minute or per 10 minutes, I guess, because per one minute is kind of stupid. I don't know, make it like for every two minutes you can only shoot 10 people. That would work on both sides, because if some guy kills you, what they'll do is they'll spawn kill you and spawn kill you and spawn kill you till you're, like, destroyed. You don't even want to play anymore. And, uh, see when you're, uh, that works both ways, because after you shoot him ten times, then, you know, it's over. And if you want to get into a firefight and shoot the other guy ten times, you can't go around shooting up civilians, you know. So, another big, uh... F, uh, part of the game, a uh, big thing they emphasize on, sorry about commentating, I'm not very good at this, anyway, is the, uh, the guns, you can tell are a big one, <laughs> gosh, 
you know, when you're commentating, you're trying to keep it all professional and stuff, and sometimes you just mess up. I almost want to cut the audio, but I know I shouldn't because I'm like 10 minutes late. Anyway, get back on track here. Overall, I think the server is a great server. I'm just going to call it a server. I think the server game is a great one. I really enjoy it. However, if there was some sort of kill limit and or bigger pallets, then I would great, really, greatly appreciate it. Also, I think some sort of aim down the sights thing would be useful for sniping because you still don't have any zoom when you're sniping. It makes it kind of hard to pick the guy off the window. And you should make it so that way you can't kill the same guy in the lobby over, say, 20 times in 10 minutes. That's just ridiculous. You know, uh, personally, I don't, I'm not all for restricting it. You know, whenever there's a new rule, everybody hates it. I don't like rules. I think that you should be able to do whatever you want. But I do think that this whole just spawn killing and stuff gets pretty annoying. Most of the time, you can just leave a lobby, and that's the end of it. However, uh, with this server especially, then it, uh, there's always somebody on here who's going to kill you. Always, 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 always. So, from, uh, from my standpoint, if you had some sort of blocking against that, that would be pretty great. Overall, I'd give the server like a 75. I think it's a good server. I think there's some things you could add on and some things you could take away. That's about all I got for you. Requested by a YouTuber left to uh, send me a private message, even though I don't really like those. So thanks for that. Said he didn't want his name on here, so whatever. Uh, Alright guys, that's about it. Thanks so much for watching. I really appreciate it. Um, all you guys out there, make sure to leave the next video that you'd like. Uh, any videos you'd want to see, just leave a comment below. I'll do my best to get those. And other than that, have a awesome day. Thank you so much for watching. Goodbye. What's up, guys? One more thing I just wanted to say. I, I'm i looking over the video. I'm trying to cut some of it out. Audi obviously, my audio that I have on here, the audio, isn't the full length of the video. So I'm going to attempt to talk about something completely random for like the next two minutes, trying to fill up some time, and then when I'm done recording this, I'm going to add it in, and there's going to be really awkward silence after I'm done talking, okay? So, um, what was I going to talk about? Well, I don't actually know. I'm not even going to try to sit here and waste my time and look stupid, so, uh, you're just going to have to, I guess, put up with some awkward silence, because I went through, tried to cut out the part that I was, like, done talking with, and Windows Movie Maker doesn't want to cooperate. So with that being said, I'm really sorry for that. Just remember to leave a comment in the video saying what you like, what you didn't like, what server you want to see next. Like, I know people have watched it. I've checked the views on the last one. They didn't leave a comment. That makes me mad. So with that being said, I'm super sorry for this. You've got about a minute of awkward silence, and I will see you later.